Hello and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Millie, Millie, Millie. And I'm back with another video. So today's video is gonna be a vlog. Um, I have a bunch of content that I've been taking over the past few months that I haven't had the chance to upload because everything was just back to back. My life, my schedule, everything was just all over the place so today's video is about my time in zimbabwe we went to zimbabwe my whole family and i um in december i think it was the first it was the first second week of december actually we were there for about five days but it was jam-packed i'm telling you like it was like hectic i probably slept like five or six hours the whole time i was there it was like that bad so like we arrived on a thursday and i spent the whole of thursday sick because we had the morning flight i was just sick I couldn't like keep food down and then the next day we my sister's wedding was on saturday so thursday friday we had wedding preps we had to get i had to get my nails done my hair done we were all over the place so um i did vlog um quite a bit during the time i don't have much footage but i will be putting in the the footage that i have and yeah so we we had my sister's wedding prep we had my sisters we did a little bridal shower prayer session for her the night before the wedding and that went well into the morning duh <laughs> and then we had her wedding on the saturday and obvious as per zimbabwean culture we had to go and do the kuperequa experience so we went and we got periquat i've got a few clips on that um i don't know how i feel about kuperequa all i know is that i probably don't want to do it again <laughs> It was so hard. It was just like, I think the hardest thing is just that you're tired. I don't mind the work, but at least if they let you rest and you know, you get some rest in, it's fine. But yeah, otherwise, yeah. So we did the Kuperequa thing, we came back and my parents decided to have a braai. The same day we were coming back from Kuperequa. So now we have this braai, everyone's at our house and Yolanda's not there anymore. So it's just me and like my family and my older sister and her family. And we have this braai and then we sleep late again. And the following day was a Monday. So my husband had told my dad that he really wants to see Great Zimbabwe because he studied it in history and whatnot, whatnot. So my dad is like, I'm the champion. Monday, we are waking up at 4.30 and we're on our way to Mashingo. <laughs> so on Monday, we went to Great Zimbabwe and then y'all can imagine, that's actually when I got some good sleep, like that drive. I think I slept for three hours straight because we left really early in the morning. But yeah, then we came back and then the following day we were back in South Africa. So yeah, here's a vlog about my time in Zimbabwe. Uh, hope you enjoy it. It was the day before the wedding, and the ladies are unprepared. <laughs> Why is everyone complaining? Just a video. Everyone was just being wild. I mean, it's just a video, so I just had to mute it because of the music playing in the background. But here is the lady of the hour. <laughs> As you can see, we were just all having fun. I was also looking crusty since everyone was against me taking videos. This is what I looked like the day before the wedding. <laughs> Big 
It's not opening though. And my nails. Move it little by little. Do I twist it? Yeah, I think it's easy. I. It's not even moving at all. Wait, and my sure hands are going. Chill, chill. It's not a thing. 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 You use the hand, you just twist. You don't look twist the picture and I hope I need to Hey, chungo for it. You just go this way. You see, it's not twisting. You saw that. You see, it's not twisting. I scoot a twist. I'm going to go for it. Yeah. I'm going to go for it. I'm going to go for it. Break up, baby. First of all, I was not there when the memo was sent out that we are going to have to dance. Um, we just had to wear matching clothes with the pedicazis. As you can see, the guys are not even wearing print. But all of a sudden, this MC just calls us to the stage, to the aisle. And is basically coaching us in how to do... <laughs> how to do dances. It took like... Actually, we never really fully got it. Everyone was doing their own dance at this point. But yeah, I guess this is the fun of it. But yeah, he was trying to get us to do the Jerusalem dance. None of us knew it. And it turns out he didn't either because he was making us do the wrong things. Please. So put small pieces in the plate. I'm just Zana, one after the other. In the name of the Czech and the King and the King of my family. Samachatanga Kona, Yolanda, Ajit Gisa, Mark, Ajolona, Nam, Gisa, Sein, Yedwa, Wata, Ura, Arigwa, Haronga. So, Camera person, please do the job. We want this one to design or sharing from the day one to 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 the day one 
Lucy was doing uh, beautiful dance on the Thank you, thank you. So Two hours later. Why do you look so depressed? Hey. Everyone is tired. Savannah is not even gonna wake up. Yes, yeah, Savannah is not gonna to a vlog. But they cook it. <laughs> Let me tell you the story about the Coke. We were so thirsty. Like I think the last time we had any water or beverage was when we left the house and we had been sitting by the gate for hours and then we went into the house and then they gave us food and they didn't give us water or juice so we were thirsty there was a bottle of coke in the corner somewhere in the cupboard so we were really really tempted to drink it and that's exactly what we were laughing about at this point and also can you guys hear the noise that was coming from outside they were literally literally throwing a party right outside the window so we didn't sleep <laughs> experience. <laughs> 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 There's so many of us on this floor. Try right, my mtingwen. Do you try right, my mtingwen? <laughs> we are within. <laughs> you can't really see anything because it's like four in the morning, my beloved viewers, and I'm shooting from my phone. <laughs> but this is what we're dealing with. We're leaving the whole dirt piles. Yes. Okay. Yeah, big sister. How are you feeling? Mm. I really ask you. <laughs> stuff in my ear at a bee chasing me. Oh they're actually not. Okay. I'm a little sleepy. <laughs> I know you should show your ring. No, oh. <laughs> <laughs> we look Sounds so shady, right? 
Oh, that's so cute. Look at that. That's a second Adam. <laughs> we came with Savannah, but Savannah went and went back to sleep. Well, we worked. This is our little sister. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> The they were using the bathroom in our, in our bedroom. Like, Who's sleeping here? Uh, so then I was like, I'm taking. 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 I'm <clears throat> hey guys, I am absolutely exhausted, like exhausted, I don't know, I am so tired that I was no longer tired, but still so tired, um, well, um, yeah, today we, um, so yeah, my day, we actually had my sisters, my sisters getting married this weekend, so on Friday night, we threw her a little bridal shower, which went well into the morning. And we had a wedding on Saturday, which went well into the morning. And then we went to get pedicot. I don't know how to say it in English. So, But yeah, so we, were, we went to take our sister to her husband's house, which went well into the day. <laughs> so y'all can imagine, I probably had, I don't know, Five hours of sleep is probably optimistic in the past 48 hours. So that's what I'm kind of dealing with. I can't even open my eyes clearly because I'm just so exhausted. But it was an experience and a half. I don't think I'll do it again. I mean, if we're friends and you want to go, probably I'm not the first person you should call. <laughs> it's fun and all, but um, yeah. And I'll take you guys through my experience and everything that happened. I have a few clips from the day. So at least I'll stay here with my phone, so no judgment. But yeah, it's I'm exhausted. Like, I'm really... And I felt sad for my sister. I mean, leaving her. I can't imagine having to be this exhausted. The exhaustion that I have and be in like a stranger's house. Not necessarily strangers. They're obviously a new family, but... You want to really be in a comfortable environment just so that you can rest. You don't want to be resting in your in-laws' house on the first time you're meeting them. But I know. So, yeah, that's a bit emo. But, guys, in all this, I still have to work. <laughs> because tomorrow, we're traveling. We're going to Great Zimbabwe. My mom and dad. It's crazy because we've been here since Wednesday. And I haven't had time to really vlog because obviously it was wedding preps all up to this time. And it's just like everything is happening so fast. I just need a day and a half to rest. But there is no day and a half to rest. And I don't know I'm blabbering right now. I have to get to work. Like, it is so sad. I closed off my fiver. But somehow I have three orders that are due. In the next 16 hours and because we're traveling to great zimbabwe tomorrow i have to have those delivered before tomorrow so that's what i'm gonna do now and then we can talk about kupirikwa another time i'll tell you guys how it went down i liked it and i didn't like it at the same time but it was an experience i didn't get to do it so i guess it was nice actually getting to do it i guess that's all i can say for now but let me go and try and work with the extra energy, with the last of the energy that I have. And yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow, I guess. Can you guys see where my family is? These guys are not even like waiting for me. I was clever enough to wear flip flops. 
<laughs> so, <clears throat> no one told me that this was going to be a hike. <laughs> so, I'm kind of behind everyone. My mother also has like sandals, so. <laughs> Wish me luck, y'all. Oh, where are rocks falling from? The sky. Oh. Okay. Hectic. I can't imagine having been a servant at Great Zimbabwe, having to climb up here, carrying stuff regularly. No. Not my portion, you. Not my portion. So, I literally pretty much make it to what I thought was going to be the top. Some nice stones here. But it's not the top. There's a bigger top. I can't even breathe. Mm. But so far, so good. I'm not sure if I can see. <sighs> okay. Unfortunately, not doing so well. I'm finally up, guys. Ooh. There's still a freaking long way to go. And I wasn't doing so well with the height. And my flip flops are letting me down. Oh, oh. oh my god. It's so high. I would not be able to go down this way. That is a fact. Because, and my son is up there asking for me. I should have video. Ah. Oh gosh. My husband has to come back to get me because I was stuck. I made it to the top. Well, almost. There's still a small onion climb. Oh wow, there's a river. Oh. My husband had to come and get me and my mom's laughing at me. <laughs> Even though she also equally struggled. She's just acting like she didn't, she was just ahead of me. <laughs> Guys, if you come to Great Zimbabwe, you need mountain climbing experience, please. And hiking shoes. And hiking shoes. It's not play play. Marty, I made it. <laughs> Mom is here. <laughs> At last. is strong. Sekuru is strong. Ah, is strong. If Sekuru came up carrying Martin, Sekuru is strong. Ah, Sekuru is very strong. <laughs> ah? Which river is that? Lake Tajiritenda will be demo when we finish the store. We will do the demo. Lake Tere? Lake Kyle. Lake Kyle. Lake Kyle. Oh wow, the Kyle River. Yes. So, Kyle so, Dam. Kyle Dam, yes, but it was later renamed in 1996. Mutiriku. Mutiriku, because Mutiriku is the main river which supplies. Oh. Uh, wow, it is so amazing. So, so Mashingo District is uh, well blessed, especially with water. The same district, that is the same district where Tugumkosi is again. Okay. Yes, so. Uh, from here to Togo Mukosi, then we see uh, it's walking distance. We can walk. which were located in here, but because of time, they all collapsed and deteriorated, so we can't even see the houses in here. And this is just a platform. It was also used as a stage by the first wife of the king, 
Remember, she was the supervisor to all these premarital lessons which were also conducted in here by the young boys and girls. So after the graduation ceremonies, that's when she offered some of the hardworking and beautiful girls to the king as new wives. That's why the number of the Thank you so much for watching my video i love you for watching as usual keep up with my content send me the likes and loves i have a poll going on like a questionnaire asking you guys about what songs you want me to cover in my cover sessions so please do go and comment either on my instagram facebook or even here in the community tab just go look for me put in a recommendation is it called a recommendation or like a what I know the word but the word is escaping me if you know the word comment it below yeah put in a yeah anyway the word has gone but if you want me to cover a song uh, for the next uh, six weeks I'll be doing only R&B songs so send me any R&B songs you would like me to cover and I will be on it like white on rice but anyway thank you for watching my video and I love you for watching. See you soon and God bless you.